Okay, welcome back. So I have read that cooking on a budget book that I found to completion and it has given me a shitload of recipes. Got some fried spam. So there are some recipes that you need a frying pan for rather than a pot. Uh, you can fry things in a pot. Why not? Okay, so I'm going to go have a look in a police station. I'm not going to take the car because it's really close and it makes a lot of noise and <laughs> uses a lot of gas yeah I'm down to about seven percent already that fox having a red letter assigned to it makes me slightly nervous red always means danger or zombie brutes at least so I'm gonna go to this police station here because I read the computer science skill book so I think that I may be able to hack the computer in there and actually get into the little locked room that they always have. Where are we? Whoops. Went a little bit past it. So there should still be some zombies around here somewhere. Oh, there's a wreckage. Hello. There are the zombies. Uh, I wonder if they get cut running over this wreckage. Wow, there's a V8 engine. Nice. It's not a very big one though. I'm I'm under the impression that V8s are not necessarily better than V6s. It's just that they have a larger capacity, which would make them better. But I'll mark it there anyway. Oops. So let's uh, entice these zombies over this wreckage. Let's move down here a little bit. Ooh, here they come. The smoker coming. So let's see if that's in any way injured. It is slightly. So they are cutting themselves on this wreckage. Very nice. Let's kill a zombie dog in one shot. I am wielding a machete, aren't I? Yes. Die. Oh, I didn't realize it was a zombie child. Come on. Uh, okay. Ah, uh, bloody spitter. Fucking, oh, it's dissolved my boots. Alright, step back a bit. Just go over this way. There we go. Yeah, what kind of acid, though, dissolves whatever it is that the combat boots are made out of? Leather, I guess. But no, um, don't they have like rubber soles that are like chemical resistant? I'm certain they do. Uh, come on. Whoops. Broke one of my lockpicks. Eh, they're so easy to make though. Well, I don't really see how a sort of bent piece of scrap metal could be used as a torsion wrench. But, you know, it's a game. So yeah, this is the jobby here. Uh, I'm going to check the other rooms first. Some metal bars. I mean, the jail cells aren't even open. Hey, a deputy match. Oh, I'm totally going to wear that. Duh, I'm a policeman. There's another one there. I wonder how many you can wear. Can you just cover yourself in deputy badges? <laughs> uh, let's try it. You put on your deputy badge. They don't cover anything, so... You can't wear more than two deputy badges at once. Yeah, you want to bet? <laughs> Uh, let's drop that then. So yeah, because they do, they do actually offer some protection, but they don't cover anything. So I think that that like, renders the protection moot. Maybe it's an empty room. Shouldn't these rooms have desks and stuff in? Oh, uh, hello. <laughs> From the west, you hear a whump. Like, oh, I broke it though. Come on. All right, let's uh, let's do something stupid. Let's just use a rocket launcher. Uh, I really hope that I can fire this through the door. Fuck me, that was um. Ugh, smoke. Thin smoke. Uh, nope. All right, let's just put on my filter mask for a minute. 
There we go. So what's on the other side of here then? Nails. Pile of rubble. Rock. Nails. Scrap metal. Utility vest. Right, here we go. Yeah. Hard arm guards. Uh, I'm going to wear those. Because I don't really care about arm encumbrance at the moment. I guess. So there's just some lockers with a bit of equipment there with really no reason for it to be under such a stringent lock. How do I get out? <laughs> there we go. Yeah, so I just blew open the police station for no reason. Take off the filter mask. Hmm, what else can we do? Well, I got my hard arm guards, but they're not exactly hard to find, really, so... What is this? Oh, it's a clothing store, isn't it? Yeah. Tights. Messenger bag. I don't think I'd be able to get away with wearing one of those. So I'm wearing quite a lot of my torso. Uh, da 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 da. Reinforced army jackets. Is that it though? Reinforced army jacket. Wasn't I wearing... Yeah, there it is. Reinforced hoodie as well. What is this in front of me? Oh, it's a kitty cat. Why am I getting so many emails? God damn it. I'm trying to record a video here. Ah, uh, that's the zombie horde ahead. Um... Single window anywhere nearby? No, I guess we'll settle for the... Come on, let me in. I break the glass, oh well. <laughs> uh, okay, so, bring it on. 40, oh shit. Alright, let's actually get my bloody weapon out. Might help. Critical. Let's throw this law. No, nope, I didn't want to drop it. I wanted to throw it. Can I throw it at him? I can. <laughs> Critical. You hit for three damage. Well, it's better than nothing. The zombie dies. Let's eat some cheese while we wait. Mmm. Drink some lemonade. Oh shit. I don't have any more drinks. That could be a problem. Uh, grab this string while I'm here. Come on. Into my window of doom. Pew! Holy crap, these sword weapons like machetes and stuff are so ridiculously powerful. They should be a whole lot more rare, I think, but... Are they still coming? I think I've forgotten them here. Let's try and clean the window so we can just hop out and let's just remind them that we're here. Give the wall a bit of a smack as well. Oh, it's attracted something there. Oh, is that a smoker? Okay. Felt a mask. <laughs> Come on. Wump. Actually, smack the wall. Get its attention. Because, yeah, I want to get it over here nice and quick, finish it off. I'm here. Come on. Where the hell is it? Are you stupid? I'm going to break the wall down in a minute. Come on. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I just accidentally pulled all the corpses in front of me. Boomer explodes. Well, I suppose it's useful. I'll grab that spray can. So what, uh, what actually happens if I activate this spray can? Spray what? Oh! Uh, eat my shorts. Written here, eat my shorts. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Oh, it's going to tell me every time I do something as well. 
Uh, well, that's just amused me. Um, is there any more coming? There should be. Yes, here they are. Hello. Smack them all. Get their attention. Oh, there are corpses in the window. Right. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that is just hilarious. So where's the... Oh, come on. Quit. There we go. Quit it. Yeah, so graffiti. It's OP. <laughs> it's, just, it's always there. Oh, the door's open on this house. So just just smoke here forever now, even after you've killed the smoker. Yeah, it's all going. So let's grab this frying pan. Which actually make a fairly decent weapon, actually. Uh rotten tomatoes, rotten grapes. Ah, oh, Shame. Holy crap. There's the rest of the horde. Yeah, that is supposed to be cigarettes there. Does that look like a cigarette to you? I don't know. It doesn't look like a packet of cigarettes. Yeah. Spitting crap on me. Critical. Alright, so I'm gonna... Do I have to move? Whoops. Um... Cause yeah, what is... What is that there? Uh, a chair. Okay. I guess it's just like a lawn chair. Right, I think I'm actually getting dissolved by the acid here. But I can't really move anywhere. I mean, I can stand in this window here, but then... Okay, so they're stupid enough to move into the window next to me. Rather than just stand outside and attack me. So that's fine then. <laughs> uh, well, we can move out of it now. The acid has... mystically disappeared. This is rather inflating my kill count here. Come on, get over it. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Your left foot is bitten. Fuck. Warm arms. Oh well. Yeah, I wish you could modify clothes a bit more. Like, you can cut the things off gloves. I wish you could uh, cut the sleeves off stuff. Because, yeah, that would be awesome, really. Mangled skeleton corpse. Uh, yes, just do it. Oh, screw it. Just pulp the corpses. I don't know how you pulp a skeleton corpse. Oh, I already butchered it, but... Never mind. Whoops, I was just smashing things instead of <laughs> examining them. Hmm. Uh, well, that's annoying. Alright, so what's over here? Cell phone. Reading glasses. Playboy. I'm gonna grab the Playboy. What's under this bed? Nothing? Okay. What is this? Boomer. Come on. Oh, fucking hell. I hate these things. Sewer rats. What are you doing up here? This isn't the sewer. Can they get through the fence? We can. <laughs> Fucking hell. The amount of blood that they spew out everywhere. That's ridiculous. Where's the body? Whoops. Just smashing the fence. Okay. Southeast, jumping spider, zombie child, zombie. So they all came out of that grocery store by the looks of it. Because that is well and truly smashed up. I think there's some more in here as well. Yes, there is. Zombie dies. Look at this hooligan. Cannabis and a spray can. 
So, oops. Window frame, sure. Where's all the glass and stuff? Yeah, I guess you don't really get glass out of a smashed window. I am just owning everything here with this machete. Like, I'm tempted to just go back to my combat knife just to make it more of a challenge, but that would be insanity. Like, deliberately making the game bad or worse, I mean. Hmm. Already have billions of aspirins. Of which I shall take some now. Best taken in threes for that damaged kidney feeling. Uh, okay, so what have we got in here? Smash that corpse. Should be lots of food in here, but all these corpses are bloody all over the place. Uh, canned salmon. That shit is so expensive. It's never that nice. Seriously. Right. Ooh, some pears that haven't gone rotten. Uh, I'm not even going to risk it with the mushroom. It's probably flagged as edible because it's in a grocery store. But I wouldn't put it past him. Alright, this spitter's on his way in. May have to make a speedy exit. So awesome. No, we don't need that. Cheese spread. Beans are usually pretty good. Ah, I'm just gonna bug out of here. Bye bye. Du -du 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 -du. Let's um whoops. Let's lead this guy over to wreckage. What are these things? What is that? That's oh, a giant jumping spider. Oh well. It's about to get dissolved, I think. Well, it can't see me anyway by the looks of things. There we go. If only you had a shovel. That is a point, actually. I could do with a shovel. There are some tools that I still need. It's just a random bit of road missing there. Have you noticed that? Whoops. Hmm, it's tempting to go get a bottle of gas and uh, fill, up, fill up one of these wreckages just for a laugh. Is that a flatbed, is it? Oh, that's an ambulance. Oh, wow. Does it have a siren on it? It's got a blue light, a red light, a couple of red lights. Oh, wow. This is cool. Uh, it just has a car horn, no siren. It does have a bed in the middle of it. But you don't actually get a bed when you remove it, you just get a seat. So, I'll just have to make do with my makeshift bed for now. It's good enough. Uh, I'm going to see if I can disarm some of these traps. It's extremely dangerous, but I'm feeling lucky. It's not even telling me what it is. That's a dirt. No, I can clearly see the traps there. Oh, really? It's not going to tell me what they are. Spiked board. Oh, well, I can see that one. Is it... Like, am I failing the perception test, but it's still telling me they're there? Ah, oh, that's bullshit. Okay, let's try and disarm the spiked boards. They're usually quite easy to disarm without any skills. It's just something to do on the way home. Let's practice my trapping skill a little bit. I can set these up around the shelter. I've done that before, like... Made a nice... Fortified shelter, but there's really no point at the moment. I think once they implement zombie hordes that just kind of show up and ruin your day, that will be a necessity, but... Yeah, until then... There really isn't any point in fortifying your shelter. Other than it just being fun. <laughs> you know, if you want to set up a, a fortress with a moat and spiked pits and stuff, then that's cool. You can do it. 
Always about choice. Okay, so just a quick uh, town raid today, and um, yeah, I'll figure out what to do next time. Probably do some more exploring in my armored car. I might even try and figure out what kind of ammo the uh, turrets use and go ride through town like a crazy maniac. But until then, thank you for watching and I'll see you later.